Hi friends! Welcome back to my channel or if you're new here, welcome! My name's KitKat and I post whatever I want. Today, I'm going to present to you my summer try-on haul. If you're someone like me who enjoys watching hauls, then you probably already know how this works. But if you're not, basically, I will be showing you the things that I bought. It might seem weird at first, but... Um, videos like these are actually very helpful, especially when you haven't shopped from certain stores before. And disclaimer, I'm not trying to brag at all. I actually bought all these with my hard-earned money. Why did my voice crack? <laughs> if you're only here to judge or if this video gets you annoyed, then please click away now. I shopped from three stores and it's actually my first time ordering from all of them. Um, the first one was Zaful and then Shein and then Ulta Beauty. For reference, I am a size small or extra small in all the clothes that I bought. It just really depends. Whatever the smallest size, that's what I get. So yeah, hope this video helps. Transition. First up, we have the high cut ribbed bandeau bikini set. It was a very strong start because I love these. Uh, I got it in a small and it fit perfectly, especially that this thing right here. You can just adjust it if it's too tight, if you want it tighter or looser, whichever. And it comes with pads which are removable see their holes so that's perfect i love 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 this so much and i loved it enough to get a white one <laughs> it's exactly the same one but in white and it also looks very nice and expensive and these are only $8.99 it fits almost perfectly considering that i'm very petite and slender so yeah the third bikini set is this the blue one which is the braided straps lace up low waisted bikini swimsuit. This definitely is my favorite. Oh my gosh, just look at the color you guys. It's so cute. This was $12.87. Not that bad. And oh my gosh, this top. Guys, I think I found the perfect style of top that suits my small boobs perfectly this was very flattering in my opinion well the um the bikini bottom was a little loose but still nice i still like it still my favorite and then the fourth and last one i got from zaful is this dress right here i'll just insert a picture here because I didn't wanna I didn't wanna try it on because this is actually for my cousin Faye. I bought this for her. It's the floral tie strap apron mini sundress. So it's kind of see-through. I don't know if you can tell, but wait, let me insert my finger inside. Oh, that sounded wrong. It's not that see-through, but it's still a little see-through. I bought this for $960. Not bad either. Moving on to Shein, um, I only bought one swimsuit. It's the high cut bikini, bikini, high cut, high cut bikini, high cut bikini, high cut, Bruh. high cut bikini swimsuit, and it comes with adjustable straps. So that's nice. I like that. I really like this top, but the bottom is too big for me. Look at that. <laughs> very cheeky very sexy i'm pretty sure i'm gonna wear this soon but not with this maybe with the red one the red zaffo bikini bottom and this was 12 dollars. the second one i got from shein is this top which i think is very very cute and dainty well it's a little big on me but it's not that bad and i love the ruche here which you can adjust. I got this for $12. The last clothing item that I got from Shein is this one. It's a rib knit top and comes with buttons in the front. It's very cute. It's cropped. I love it. And it was $8. This comes in a lot of colors like gray, black, pink, and purple, I think. And if I will be ordering from Shein again, I'll definitely get this in black 
or gray. The next few items from Shein are stuff for the house. You know you're an adult when you buy stuff for the house when these things excite you. Moving on to the next item is my phone case. I did introduce this in my last video which is me learning popular TikTok dances and if you want to check that out just click on this link here or I'll link it down below so you can watch it next. In terms of protection, I would say this is a 3. It's pretty decent considering it's only $3. It's only $3, guys. And I love friends, so I had to get it. I'll be there for you. Next one is this, which is the 3 tier hanging bag. It was only $4. I bought this mainly because I wanted to use this as storage for my intimates, but looking at it now it's very small and i don't think it's gonna fit all of them so i might just put um accessories here so i'm gonna move on to the next one which is this this is a rainbow brush i bought this for my hydro flask because the regular sponges do not really clean them that well so i decided to buy this this was only one dollar you guys very worth it. I'd give this a 10. Next item is this one. Can you guess what this is for? I'll give you three seconds. Three, two, one. Okay. This is actually a gel funnel for a pan. This was also just one dollar. I love to cook ramen, especially at night. So this will definitely come in handy. Imagine this was the pan, the side of the pan, and then you just put it there. And then you just pour to the bowl. Easy peasy. Oh, this is actually the last one from Shein. And it's this. Oh my gosh, it's almost as big as my face. Um, this is a plastic spoon. This was just $150. It basically acts as a strainer for when I eat pancit canton or pasta or whatever. I just use this. Okay, last store is ta-da! I'm not that into makeup, but I am getting the hang of it and I am starting to love it. That's why I decided to shop from Ulta. And like I said, it's my first time buying from them. So I kind of went overboard. In total, I bought one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and nine the first one is actually the first two ones the first two ones that sounds weird the first two that i got are the lash sensational mascara by maybelline um i've been using this since 2015 or 2016 it's 9.99 dollars I got two because I'm running out. Um, the next one, this is actually my favorite nude lipstick and it's by MAC. The shade is Velvet Teddy and here it is. So nice. Wait, I should do that makeup thing. Oh, is it focusing? I don't know. I love this. This looks very nice on the lips. I'm not actually wearing it right now, but yeah, it's my favorite. However, I have only recently found out that MAC until now isn't cruelty free. So I'm gonna try to look for a dupe because I just don't want to support a brand that uses animals to test their products. It's just very wrong. If you have nude lip recommendations, please do um, comment down below. The next one is this. It's my favorite drugstore highlighter. It's from Wet n Wild. This was... Did I say how much this was? Okay, this is $19 now. Going back. This is $5.99. The next one is this. This is the NYX Professional Makeup Eyeliner. And this is my very first eyeliner that I bought because a few days ago, um, my mom gave me her eyeliner and I started using it and I really liked it. So I got one myself. I'm wearing it right now and my wing isn't perfect. I know, don't judge me. It's only like my third or fourth attempt, so be nice, okay? It comes with a very, very thin tip. See that? Yeah. Yuck. Yeah. <laughs> 
This one, $750. Would I buy it again? Yes. Moving on to the Maybelline um, Fit Me Concealer. Did I get that right? Yes. These two are in the shade Light. I'm not wearing it right now. I actually have yet to try it. But based on the reviews by other people, this is really nice. And it's also cheap. This was $6.99. Okay, last one. Finally, finally. Ta-da! I got two again. <laughs> this is the Maybelline Fit Me Blush. Um, I got it in the shade... Is it the shade or color? I don't know. Color. Okay. It comes in the color rose and I love it. It's what I'm wearing right now. Gives you that um, rosy cheeks that you like that I like particularly. That is it for the video. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like and comment if you want. I'm gonna link everything down below in case you wanna check a thing or two out. Stay safe, wash your hands, and drink your water. Bye!